<laughs> Welcome back to my channel. We're off to see one of the most beautiful lighthouses here. So stay tuned. to leave I wanted to quickly show you it's a beautiful day today I don't know if you can see it behind me it's a little cold it's plus one right now it's a beautiful day and as you can see our yard gets less and less snow let me show you quickly what that mess looks like it's been quite quite a thing look at the last piles that are still around and the wind is blowing now. Hey, yeah, yeah, you don't want that. But finally, things are clear. There's a little bit of the front. But it's getting there. Flowers are coming out everywhere. So you can see that the birds are. Uh, singing as you can hear that as well there's tulips a lone crocus but everywhere there are flowers coming and snow bells the only ones i have but they're coming out really beautiful it's definitely also some damage that the winter has done and all the snow not happy about that but it is what it is, we have to live with it, so... The grounds move quite a bit here on PEI when things freeze, so... As you remember, we put in a cement pad. Let me show you what it did to our brand new cement pad that we... It's not even a year old yet. But yeah, that whole section lifted up. And there's cracks in the ground. And then some of the things here we bought last year, unfortunately, as you can see, they cracked. We have to live with that. See if anything can be done. I think the cement was still wet. That's why it cracked. The same with this one as well. So we have to call the company that uh, made this, but that should have not happened. Really disappointing, there was no water in it because it rained. So let's see what we can do. And as you may see, there is the fence sunk in. That one post here sunk into the ground and started to dra drag down the fencing, so that needs to be fixed. But these are the things that are happening with all the freeze, freezing and all the snow. So let's go, let's have, first we need some breakfast. So we're gonna go to Kensington to the Corner Cafe. Great place, love it there. Great breakfast, great value too, so. Let us show you that as well on the way down to the Prim Lighthouse, I believe it's called. But it's gorgeous. Let's see how beautiful this day is today. Sunny, zero degrees, but gorgeous. It's early in the morning, so we thought we'd leave early, go drive around today and show off more of Prince Edward Island. So we're actually gonna go to the Brick House Lighthouse first, which is by Charlottetown, right there. 
and then the other lighthouse is here so we'll go there afterwards now turn right and, onto Road. and here is the prim point prim lighthouse and that's the one i really wanted to show so two lighthouses today should be stunning it is beautiful maybe a little windy but we'll see how it goes down there do have a look the snow is almost gone hardly any snow left and that's how we like it it is early march so no early april never mind I, I, I. corner cafe like always I forget to take pictures of the food that we got just had breakfast two eggs some avocado with it uh, just amazing amazing food it's always good food it's quite reasonable priced when we got in there our friends Leslie and Jason and Leslie's dad were there as well they had an early outing uh, to Cavendish so it was great to see our English friends Anyway, if you're ever in Ken uh, Kensington, you want breakfast or lunch, do check out the Corner Cafe. Like I said, it's right across the Kensington pub, uh, the railway station that is in that little village town. Okay, now off to the Brick House Lighthouse. That was our first lighthouse we have ever seen on PEI or visited. And I leave it. Uh, link to it below when we saw it it was over a year ago and that's when we still had our all three puppies but i'll leave a link and today i'll try to show that lighthouse in the sun and in a drone video see you there getting close unfortunately we can't drive all the way down so I'll see if I can get the drone down. bit of the lighthouse not what I was hoping to get so but better than no pictures at all we're off to the Point Prim lighthouse now but we got a charge first in Charlottetown and ensure we got enough power to get back home see you there So we got a few minutes to charge here, about 15. It uh, doesn't cost us anything because we have a free lifetime charging with this car. So after that, we're gonna go to Point Brim, 
probably some shopping in between, which I'm not going to film. <laughs> I don't think you're interested in that. And then go and see the lighthouse. there another 10 kilometers to go this seems to be farmland and cottage country out here we came here some time ago to look at a cottage but never made it out to the lighthouse so this will be our first time to the lighthouse okay this is now point prim we just uh, drove by the sign and this is where obviously people live year round, but also cottage country. It's beautiful out here. You are on a peninsula and you got water to the left, you got water to the right. I do remember looking at a cottage that was on the right hand side and had an incredible view of the ocean and the beaches were down below so but it was more of a cliff and you didn't really have beach access but it was beautiful maybe we'll see it like i said it's been a, a year don't remember exactly where it was but i know we'll pass it so that's a mirror look at this i love that tree full of boys now that is a Christmas year, a tree all year round. Well, here are some cottages or houses that people live. So beautiful. You see the ocean in the back. And down below the beaches. Very common on PEI, there's still a lot of roads that are dirt roads, gravel roads. And during this time of year, they turn it into mud roads. Turn left to stay on point. Restaurant during the summer. Looks like there was some damage from the winter that is happening. The Point Prim Chowder House and Oyster Bar. Seafood, cocktails, and beer. This is like an incredible spot to come in the summer. It's a little windy today, but I'm sure in the summer this is beautiful. Let's go in, let's have a look at the lighthouse.
the wind was cold. My hands are freezing, but it was worth it. So I like, I hope you enjoyed it. If you did like the video, you know what to do. So subscribe, like, share with your friends and family and do tell them to subscribe as well. Do make sure you hit that notification bell so you know when I release new videos every Sunday. Thank you for watching and see you next time.